Welcome to Vero Coffee. Today we're going to show you how to remove and clean the Brewer Group from a Blue Dot espresso machine. Okay, firstly, key in the top, turn, open the door. The machine will power itself off so it's safe now to put your hands inside the machine. Open the door fully and the bottom door fully. Remove the blue waste container. Put it to one side. Brewer Group is this section here where the espresso is brewed into your cup. So firstly, the red lever, slide across to the left. Okay, and then we follow this pipe. Okay, and we just to the side, I'm gonna press in, to remove the pipe. Now, the unit itself, in a downwards action, down, lift up, and it removes. So you can remove the brown pipe here at the side. Now the unit is free from the machine. Now having removed the unit, we're going to just gently rinse with cold water under the tap. Taking care to clean the cog area here. Any buildup of coffee here will throw up an error if it's replaced in the machine. So you can literally, you can wind these by hand very gently. And back again, you can see it moves so literally. So we're just rinsing any coffee dust or, dust or residue from the brewer group. Little shake, take any excess water off, and then we will bring it back to the machine. Now, before we put it back into the machine. Just this general area, so it's where the coffee falls into the brewer. We don't want any coffee to stick here because it's wet, so paper towel. And just any excess water, just give it a quick wipe. If you are doing this overnight, you can just leave it on the drain board and it should be dry in the morning time. Okay, so if we look on the back of the group, we can see a grooved ridge going all the way across so this sits on stainless steel bar the back of the machine okay so we put our brown pipe on now put the ridge onto the stainless so we're going to into the bar at the back that's it it's on there and this time with an upwards force until we hear a slight click the brewer group back in, back down here, our pipe just pushes in, and you hear another small click, and then we lock it back into position. And that's our brewer group back in the machine. Got our waste bin, just taking care not to bend this pipe. Back in, close the bottom door, top door. Machine will go through a startup sequence and we can turn it back on to put into normal service. We recommend we do this process at least two to three times every week prior to running a cleaning cycle. 